Lynn Fisher from the Federal Housing Finance Agency, here with the latest in our quarterly video series on house prices in the United States. Today, we release the House Price Index report and data for the second quarter of 2021. The second quarter took over the record for the largest annual gain in the history of our house price index. House prices rose 17.4% from the year prior. This surpasses the prior quarter's gains of 12.9%, which was the previous record. As always, our headline numbers are based on our seasonally adjusted purchase-only index. Why do we continue to see record-setting house price increases in the U.S.? Mortgage rates have remained at their lowest level since the 1970s. While new listings have recovered to match prior year's levels, houses have not been staying on the market for long. The increased demand has kept the inventory of houses for sale very low, leading to intense competition and rapid price increases. Over the last four quarters, house prices rose in all 50 states, as well as the District of Columbia. The largest gains were in Idaho, Utah, Arizona, Montana, and Rhode Island. The Mountain Division once again had the strongest annual growth among all census divisions hosting a 22.9% year-over-year house price gain. The region has led an annual appreciation for 15 consecutive quarters as in-migration from the West Coast has continued. Records are being set across the nation. Annual gains surpassed 20% in two other regions, the Pacific and the New England divisions, and in all of the top 20 metro areas. Recent purchase mortgage application activity a leading indicator of home sales, suggests that the pace of sales nationwide will slow in the coming months relative to a year ago, which could mean that house price growth will moderate later in the year. To see the full report, please visit fhfa.gov forward slash HPI. You can also explore the latest data using interactive maps and tools like the HPI calculator. Finally, the FHFA House Price Index series will return in November with updates and new data for the third quarter of 2021. For FHFA, I'm Lynn Fisher. Thanks for watching.